The Miami Dolphins surprised some people this offseason when they gave tight end Mike Gesicki the franchise tag, with Mike McDaniel coming in to be the head coach, and knowing how important blocking at the position is to his offense, returning a tight end who doesn't do much of it wasn't necessarily expected, regardless, the Dolphins opted to do so. And while there was much discussion in the media and fan base about what position he should be considered in the tagging process, in an episode of Brenneman Shows Up, a podcast hosted by Arizona State tight end coach Adam Brenneman, Gasicki spoke about the process and the moment he found he got tagged, honestly, it's kind of just like a waiting game, Gasicki said. You know when the tag deadline is, and you know that it's a possibility, but you don't know what's going to happen. I was on my honeymoon in Bora Bora, and the tag deadline was the next day, and it was still up in the air. I didn't know if I was going to be able to hit free agency, if they were going to tag me. And then I got a text at like 3.30 a.m. Bora Bora time from my agent, and he was like, hey, they're tagging you. I rolled over in the middle of the night and looked at my phone, tapped Hallie, and was like, hey, we're staying in Miami another year, getting married and then getting an $11 million payday a couple of days later isn't a bad deal. However, some wondered if that payday should have been the $18.4 million that wideouts received on the tag this offseason. Gasicki was asked about being tagged as a tight end. And he responded as only he could, I'm not a big controversy guy, he said. 